Their size or numbers may be small, not even close to 1.5%, but 3,000 rotten or bad apples can taint and quickly infect much of the entire basket of 228,000 straight and responsible law enforcers if left unchecked. Our Patrick de Jesus has more on the newly minted top cop pleading to the public to say something if they see something in helping clean the ranks of the PNP. Around 3,000 cops with derogatory records are being closely monitored by the Philippine National Police. Extortion and involvement in illegal drugs are but a couple of serious crimes by PNP Chief Police General Benjamin Acorda Jr. investigated when he was still Intel Chief. Case build-up is ongoing against those police scalawags. Acorda said, this is just a minimal number in proportion to the 228,000 total police force. However, internal cleansing efforts are being intensified in which the public can and is urged to participate. Para tuloy-tuloy na tayo ay naglilinis, uh, sana yung uh, open yung communication line natin, uh, wag matakot na magsumbong kung may mga katiwalian and yung ating kapulisan din hinihikayat ko na magkakaisa na para yung tiwala ng tao ay Andyan, palagi, we will make sure that we will cleanse ourselves also. Yung kami-kami rin, uh, kung ano nakikita namin na problema, ay sasabihin. Meanwhile, the PNP plans to dissolve special operating units, a radical move to improve anti-illegal drug operations and transparency led by the PNP's Drug Enforcement Group. Yung mga regional officers ay uh, talagang i-consolidate na to make sure that the activities and the operations are really monitored. And then we will give uh, the uh, uh, RDAUs yung talagang kwandi nila, yung uh, aggressive na operations. A stricter vetting process is also underway for cops to be assigned in drug enforcement units. Patrick De Asus for The Nation.